Prince William and Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, will be embarking on a three-day tour of the British Isles on the famous royal train. So what is the royal train, and why is the couple's tour on the train so significant? Travelling via the royal train is considered a prestigious honour, with only the Queen able to permit people to use the service. The current royal train first came into service in 1977 in celebration of the Queen's Silver Jubilee. The royal family has had its own dedicated train since the reign of Queen Victoria, who was encouraged by her husband Prince Albert to embrace train travel. While you may expect the royal train to be incredibly luxurious, in reality the train is far from this and is thought to be very functional. The train consists of nine carriages, and the Queen's carriage is air-conditioned and electrically heated, and features its own bedroom, sitting room, desk and dining area. The Queen's quarters also includes a bathroom and her own full-sized bath. Prince Philip has his own saloon carriage of similar design with a kitchen, green curtains, matching chair cushions and a brown carpet. Scottish landscapes and Victorian prints of earlier rail journeys hang in both the Queen and Prince Philip's saloons. Prince Charles also has his own lounge car complete with a bedroom, bathroom and study with a small writing desk, and a blue and white floral pattern sofa with matching curtains. There are also other carriages on board for staff, including dining cars, a general purpose saloon for senior staff with sleeping quarters, a sleeping car for junior staff with bunk beds and a carriage for escort staff and maintenance workers. As for the train's exterior, the train is painted a burgundy color known as Royal Claret, and the train is emblazoned with royal crests with black coach lining and a grey roof. The royals are said to like the transportation method for its efficiency, as overnight trips can be made which reduces the need for a really early start. The train has also been used in the past by the royal family for trips to Sandringham in Norfolk and Balmoral in Scotland. The train operates on eco-friendly biofuel made from waste vegetable oil, but the train is not regularly used nowadays due to the costs involved. The train's journeys made by the royal family during the year of the Golden Jubilee in 2002 cost £872,000 of taxpayer money.